Hello everybody and welcome back to sub-level 1 of the x Not base of the final chapter, or penultimate chapter, I think this is the final chapter, or penultimate. I don't know, one nearing the end game of Let's Play Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. Go ahead and put the crane right there and now we have a little, what's the word I'm looking for? Wait, is this the prize ball thing? Wait a minute, wait a minute. Kinda of forgot what this is. Um Yeah, this is the claw. Okay. So we're just doing this to go ahead and grab those their badges. I don't really care about the uh uh, coins because well, they're just single coins. Well, I want the badges and the star piece. Badges that I think I already have, come to think of it. Is that a feeling fine badge? Yes, it is! Oh, well. I think I already have feeling fine. Plus, I just like that name. Feeling fine. Crap! That's what I get for constantly tapping A, even at points when it does nothing, in hopes that it'll speed up the action. Alright, come on. Spotlight is on star piece. The claw is kind of going through it, but oh well. Okay, so we got a star piece, and now to go for the feeling fine partner badge. Speaking of badges, considering that uh, Cross Yuck's debacle. I probably should go ahead and equip some more badges instead of being a stubborn guy. Yeah, I think I will. As opposed to just only this cosmetic uh, W emblem badge. Well, I have been using. Well, no, I don't think I'm gonna need Quake Hammer anymore. Yeah, okay, I'll take. I'll keep Chill out. Damage dodge, I will keep. Uh, yeah, I don't need ice power anymore. Need Quake Hammer. I don't think I'm gonna need Spike Shield either. At least for the rest of this chapter. I will keep those in, though. Okay. Let's go ahead and sort these. Hmm. Now. Put vanilla damage dodge on Mario. Why do I keep saying vanilla? Double dip, don't need it. Hmm. Oh, when did I take off hammer, bro? Well, I guess I didn't notice that. So item hall. Make it likelier that I'm so here for battle. Eh, I don't need that. Extend, look at start. Lucky Star just makes the battles take longer, so I'll, I'll just keep that on. I need Peekaboo. Let me see, I might just go ahead and equip Quick Change. Huh. I don't think I've ever used Tornado Jump. Like, ever. Well, I'll keep that in mind, but right now I'm just going to go ahead and equip, equipping Quick Change and... Does this effect increase a multiple? No. Hmm. And that can confuse enemies. Why would I even equip that? 
<laughs> Alright, well, I'll just go ahead and equip uh, Hammer Throw. Why not? Oh, wow, I got one more. Eh, screw it. There's be one BP left over. I thought that was a sticky note we could read. Apparently not! Okay, now for some quick travel. There's another place we can now visit here on this floor. Or maybe not, because I don't have the access code. Where do you find the access code? I forgot this. Oh, man. I've really forgotten. Where do you find it? Maybe it's on one of the other sub-levels? I thought all I needed was the key card for that. Why do I just... <laughs> that always happens. I just keep tapping A, and then I select the one thing I don't want to select. That's when impatience gets you, people. Buttons pressed that you didn't want to press. Okay. Seriously, where do I find the access code? I think it's in one of those rooms. Or was it in Grotus's room? And I'll have an elevator key! Wow, I genuinely forgot what I need to do. Uh... There has to be something in Grotus's road. Or not. Okay, um, one moment while I figure out what the hell I'm doing wrong. On the bright side, at least there are no enemies I have to deal with. That's always a good thing. Oh, I didn't even read these. Okay, how do I get this switch? Left, right, middle, do not forget. Oh, I activated that by accident! Okay, today's code is... Oh, shit. Let me write this down somewhere. Yeah, this will do. Okay, today's code is 014029. Do not forget it. I will not. Because I wrote it down. Okay, then. I knew it was something I was missing. But yeah, I was just too focused on that... Uh, Easter egg to even think like maybe I should try reading the sticky notes <laughs> okay now we're gonna actually progress yay and didn't really need Yoshi for that little stretch of the hallway but whatever okay so zero one four zero Two, nine. Yes. Is this code accepted? Yeah, yeah, new area. Well, really a room, but whatever. Up. Oh, we got a thwomp. You know what that means. Who are you, huh? You came here to get the elevator key so you can access the computer room? Yeah, I thought so. Well then, you're gonna have to beat me to get it. And if you lose, your life is mine, you hear me? Mine! So what do you say? Yeah, let's challenge this chump. Mm-hmm, hoo-ha-ha, -ha. you're mine now. Yes, it is quiz show time! And here we go, folks, the main event, the 66th annual quirk quiz, yay! If you get five correct answers to the following questions, then you win, win, win! But if you get just three wrong answers, you're toast. You don't want to be toast, folks. No. Despite the fact that toast can be delicious. Okay, well, what are we waiting for, huh? Here we go, question number one. Exactly what's hidden here? The elevator key. Sure, it's not a mun key. Yay, we're right! Yar, you're correct, crud. 
But that was an easy one. You won't do so well on the next one, I guarantee that. Here we go, sucker. Now, question number two. What's the name of the girl in Petal Bark who's waiting patiently for Coops' return? Petuni? No. Marilyn? Ha, no. Flavio? That's just wrong, yo. But no, it is in fact Koopy Koo. <laughs> Yarg! You're correct, crud. But that was an easy one, yeah, okay. He guarantees this one won't be as easy. Now, question three. Goomba, Lava Bubble, Buzzy Beetle, and Boo. How many feet do they have total? Huh. Ha ha ha! Defeat! I like that one. Let's see. Boos have no feet, Lava Bubbles have no feet, Goombas have two, Buzzy Beetles have... Huh, do Buzzy Beetles have two or four? I'll go ahead and say four, so two plus four equals six. Yay! Alright. On to question four. It's elementary for non-idiots. Where is the one, the only, Diamond Star? Damn. Uh, I don't keep track. Okay, Glitzville had, you know, the the gold one. Was it possibly Saint? Possibly Saint was red. Hooktails. Cortez's shit. Ah, crap. Okay, well, I'm dumber than dumb. Remember, three strikes and you're out, loser. Might as well just get two wrong answers just to show off the final question. That way I don't have to edit it in like I did with the first quiz show. Now question five. What was the name of the very first champion in the Glitzville Arena? Prince Mush, Prince Macho, Prince Marsh, Prince Matthew. It's Prince Mush. Garg, you're correct, you jerk. You've already gotten four correct, you're kidding me. Well, fine, I'm gonna toss an extra hard one your way. You happy now, suckers? Now for question six. What did Francesca and Frankie from Rogueport lose on Kill Hall Key? Wow, seriously, that, that's easy. A necklace, a bracelet, a ring, or a bling? Well, technically speaking, rings do in fact bling. I mean, it was ring, but since I want to show off the last answer, a bling. Okay, it would be so messed up if I screw up on this final question when I want to show it off. Dude, where is that crystal, like, the diamond crystal star at? Oh, I can't remember. Huh. All right. Anyway, here's our last question. What number of question is this? Ha! <laughs> wow, really? Okay. Yeah. Uh, number seven. Yes, I'm sure. No. C correct. That's five correct answers. Crud. You win. I'm so mad right now, I can hardly see straight. I lose. I lose! Fine, but I really hate you. Take this, you bum. Wow, sore loser much? Alright, we got the elevator key, so now we can go to sub-levels 3 and 4. Hopefully one of them has a save point, because, um... Yeah. Granted, I'm having fun, but I kind of need to stop. <laughs> that was the only reason I went ahead and recorded another little... Part right now. This is all in one session. I mean, I don't absolutely need to stop right now, but if I want to eat before I go into work, yeah, I kind of do. Alright, so we insert that there. Elevator key. And now we can go to sub-levels 3 and 4. I want to go to sub level four right now. And I will go sub level three. Okay, wow, enemies. Haven't seen them in a minute. Alright, well then let's go ahead and get Goombell out. Why not? Oh, we're fighting the X-Naught family. Okay then. Uh what do I want to take out first? I'll take out PhD first. Good old Butter Pecan. Oh, okay, well then. Umbella, can you take out chocolate? Damn it, you cannot take out chocolate. Alright. Crap, tried to super guard. Not expecting that one. Crap. 
Oh well, doesn't matter. They're all about to die anyway. And bonk him. What are you about to do? Steroids. Okay, he did steroids. Daisy! What is... <sighs> Curse you, Daisy. Curse you. Putting my audience to sleep. Only three of them cheered that stylishness. How sad. Nine away from leveling up. Let me hurry up and do it without dying. That would be a nice thing to do. Oh, we got another one of these. Ah, oh, crap. Wow, I might die here. Okay. HP drain. Alright. Come on. Oh, there might be some hidden. Hey. Come on. Why we gotta circle around? This is pointless. Hit anything hidden? Okay. Just gotta check for anything that might be hidden. Paranoid like that. Okay. Phew. He tried to trick me out there up on the end. Got a card key. Here, I think there might be something hidden. Or not. Oh well. I know in my luck there was, and I was just too blind to the sight, or just forgot. Or no, anything in between. Oh, wow, we got some yuxes there. Oh, boy. Boy, 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 boy. It looks like I won't be leveling up either. At least in this fight. Alright. At least that one went by quickly. Okay, and what's here in this room? Might need to go back to the entrance and save, kind of thing. Oh, wait. Please insert the card key. Oh, okay. Wait a minute, is this about to be a boss fight? I can't remember! Like. My memory is just so hazy of this place! Oh no, we're in this room. The PhD! Wow, there are so many of you guys. Um... Uh, yeah, it looks like I won't be getting an art attack on. Okay, wait a minute. Because I forgot, I have the power of Quick Change! And Bobri has the power of a bomb! There we go. And we've even leveled up. <laughs> Let me go ahead and raise that BP. don't want to go back to the very beginning just to save, because that would surely mean all the uh, enemies will respawn. Hold up. Wait, how do I get through this? Uh, oh, wait a minute, that's right. First I do this. And then I get Vivian out here. I haven't seen Vivian in a minute. Maybe I should use her a little more. Well, hell, I never use Flurry. Maybe I should use Flurry, too. 
Okay. So I'll just keep going till I reach the next save point. So what if this one runs a bit long? I am starving. <laughs> We got some standard 2D platforming. Crap. Okay, fine. Gonna have to be patient, I guess. Ah, being patient. It hurts so much. All right, we got an ultra shroom. Wow. Oh, that was a fail and a half. Oh, well, we're right back here. So we just go back up here and do it again. I got that Ultra Shroom, so that's all that matters. That's the most important thing right now. It's more important than friendship. It's more important than courage. I don't even know where I'm going with this right now. Okay. And now we traverse the gear. All right. Okay. Let's wait for that platform. And down here we go. And now we can fly like paper and get high like planes. I think this is where I need it. Damn! Okay, well then, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and heal. Didn't need to heal. The phone is ringing. That's my signal to go ahead and stop. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take care of this first. All right, and the Yuxes are dead thanks to Art Attack. And next time we're going to finish doing what we need to do in this here uh, place. So yeah, might as well heal again. That did not restore my star power. That was a waste of 10 points. Oh, well, thank you all for watching. Have a great day. And see you next time when we, yeah, we actually will be able to complete this next time. All right, goodbye.